Wake up. Wake up. Wake up. We are not dreaming. <laughs> the ultimate despair himself. Ultimate lucky student. The Joker, the troller, the black Air Force energy man himself has fallen. Mm, by the time I realized I was looking at the remains of Nagito Komeda, the ultimate liquor student, he got killed, killed. He got dead. Look at this shit. Huh? Huh? What? What the? What's going on here? Are you serious? Is he really dead? He's not pretending to be dead, is he? I mean, he's Nagito, you know? That's right, it is Nagito. He's always messed with us, confusing us. That's why. Can't believe him. So it's true. A body has, A been, body discovered. has been discovered! Then it's going to start again. The killing. The first round. Yep, we gotta do it! We gotta find out who Nagito's killer is! Actually... Don't worry! The end is near! Huh? The end? The What's final the chapter matter? is close? Don't make a face like a pig that's about to become bacon! You know this too, right? <laughs> the meaning behind that Monokuma timer? When it reaches from zero, two days from now... What? What, what will happen to us? Huh? Huh? The killing school trip will be over! Hey, hey! If it'll finally be over. You serious? Does that mean we can go home? What are you gonna do? Don't count your bears before they hatch. There's still something you gotta do before that. So... So once again... It's the Monokuma file! Phew! Alright, let's, let's see what the fuck happened to Nagato. Alright. That's his student profile dead. Damn, this motherfucker. My guy had two of his hands ripped, his fucking thighs, through his chest, through his left arm. I know that I have to investigate Nogtil's body. He probably didn't expect to end up like this either. Love. Alright, Monokuma plushy. Why is there a hole through you? Monokuma's dead. There's blood coming out of his stomach, making a hole like he got stabbed through. And during the hole of blood, did he try to imitate Nagito's body or something? What are you saying? I had nothing to do with that. Huh? If it wasn't a Monokuma trick, then who did this? Could the killer have done this? If so, is this Nagito's blood? I have no idea how this connects to an incident. What's this down here? A bunch of plastic bottles, remnants of the plastic, are scattered over. This is probably when we chuck those grenades. What's this? A oil lighter. Where the currents would have been hanging. It looks like the fire did the extent of damage here. Monagito must have set the fire off in the first place. Well? Oil lighters can continue to burn even after someone lets go of them. You are right. The killer probably planned to destroy the evidence by sending this warehouse on fire. He caused a fire to destroy evidence? It's the only reason I can think of. Never expected Nagito to die like this. He was always spamming nonsense and hope and trying to confuse the hell out of us. Maybe so dying like this is just too cruel. Like it wasn't completely useless. Those times where we only were able to reach the truth because of them. More like every fucking time. Damn, Nagito, you got fucked up. Burnt rope. Why isn't Nagito's com clothes completely unaffected by the fire when he was so close to the blaze? Thinking. The knife is stepped right through Nagito's hand. Did the killer do this? How could they do something cru so cruel? Which means after the killer was finished stabbing Nagito's legs and arms, they stabbed through, right, his, through his right hand. It cannot be. Then they finished him off with a spear. How cruel. Why did they need to use a spear? You are right. That is definitely strange. Was there a reason? He must be in great pain. He clearly had this agonizing look on his face when he died. His mouth is covered by duct tape. Was this to keep Nagito from screaming for help? Ah, uh, got a minute? Sorry, excuse me. Is he gonna take it off? To next to Nagito's face? <laughs> and in one swift movement, she ripped off the duct tape off his mouth. <laughs> Fucking savage, Yaki. <laughs> it's gonna be fine. It'll be fine. I'll put it right, right away once I'm done investigating. Hey, hey, hey! Bring the duct tape back into the issue, you ungrateful swine. You're gonna get cursed. Scallywagon. <laughs> The blood on Nagito's face. Looks like it came mostly from the slice on his left arm. If that's the case, 
Man. It's no use, she's not listening. Hey, hey. Hey, about the blood splattered on his face. There's no blood under the duct tape. Because the duct tape was covering it. Huh? What's wrong with that? Well? The duct tape has crinkles like it was sticking towards the inside of his mouth, right? Nagito was probably desperate moving his mouth under the duct tape. <laughs> Seriously, what's wrong with that? It means that Nagito's mouth was covered with duct tape before he got the wounds. He tried to shout, which caused the duct tape to get sucked in his mouth a bit. What's wrong with that? Is that something we need to worry about? Alright. <laughs> Super difficult. Hmm, there's a strange... Th there's something strange. Strange what? See? Over near the palm of his hand. I think that blood is from when his left arm was sliced, but... Doesn't the blood spot look strange? It cuts off right in the middle of his palm. Yeah, it definitely cuts off. Maybe that's as far as the blood could have reached it, but it goes around. When you flip it over and look at the back of his hand... Well? There's, on, there's also blood, but it's only above and, mi uh, and above the middle joint of each finger. See? Strange, right? Hmm. I win. <laughs> what? Yeah, sure, you win. Spirit with a fleshy ornament is impaled deeply into Nagito's stomach. Um. Like I saw in Nezumi Castle. What? What? Nezumi Castle? What the hell? I was designed to be afraid of mice, so I can't go in there. <laughs> Damn you, mice! Damn you to hell! <laughs> Even he doesn't know inside the castle. Well, no, more importantly, said like the part has blood on it too. For some reason, the cord doesn't have blood on it. This section of the cord, maybe it was wrapped around. It's about the size of a human fist. A human fist? Someone could have grabbed it. He could have grabbed it. I know Chucky mentioned this earlier, but apparently the spear came from Nezumi Castle. Might be better if I confirm that later. I'll have to confirm it? Damn it. Even so. Well, even this was torture. There's no doubt that Nag the killer must have held a deep grudge towards Nagito. Damn it! Refusing to let him die easily. I could only totally understand a dark impulse like that. Huh? I feel like Blame is gonna come towards Akane in this trial. That is gonna be bullshit. See? You see the red string? Huh? There's blood on it? I see it. There's a small red line on the ceiling. Perhaps. Is it blood? Blood? Kind of definitely looks like blood. There's no way of blood getting up there, right? Plus, it's a straight line. Mm. That's why I've been staring at it. It is definitely strange. I should remember this. Um. Man, for Gundam's killing and for Mikan's. But it looks like it's different from this time. It doesn't matter this time. What does it matter? So. Time. Looks like the time doesn't matter. It was clearly written in the Monokuma file. The time of death was noon sharp. If the. If it was at noon, what were you doing at that time? Hmm. What were you doing? Well, right now it's... It's time! 12.30pm. That means Nagito died 30 minutes ago. Ooh. Hmm. If it happened 30 minutes ago, wasn't it around the time we were struggling with the bombs? Yeah, the fake bombs were originally supposed to explode at noon. Alright! Which means whoever doesn't have an alibi, well, we're all there though. MB3 player? That's where the music came from. Why was the killer playing music? I don't know, probably enjoying himself. Hmm, there's a lot of tipped over Monokuma panels. Oh, they were to the right. Hmm. Maybe we're the ones who made this mess. Huh? See? Looks over the tip panel by the entrance. Is that close to the door, right? So maybe the reason the panel's tipped over is... He, she kicked it open. They're starting from the entrance back to the warehouse, right? Two of them are lying on top of each other in a straight line. Yeah, come over to the tip panel or tipped over panels, that's the line. So... Isn't it clearly strange? Yeah, that means you can speculate that this was done intentionally. Let's see on here. Hey Sonya, do you have a minute? Um Yes, what is it? I'm just talking about the fake bomb now you can set up in a warehouse to explode. Huh? Huh? Right before it exploded, you said something like this, right? It was a fake. It's alright, it's not a bomb. How did you know? Um, well, it's not it either. When we were looking for the bombs, yeah, you didn't come with us. While we were at the military base. Plus, when I called for you, you didn't come to the factory right away. What were you doing that time? Oh my. Oh my. It cannot be. Do you, 
Do you suspect me? Yes, even though I have a full free time event with you. It's a misunderstanding. I'm not the killer. Jesus, shit, you son of a bitch. <laughs> Oh my god, she's crying too. It's an adorable little <laughs> cry. This is the best. Sonia? I am sorry. I'm terribly sorry, I was panicking. Um... I shall calm down and explain to you while I was at the military base. When I first explored the uh, first final island, I discovered a vast amount of bombs there. Huh? Well? First, I was worried that they were going to be used for nefarious reasons. So I kept silent the whole time. So when you heard the pl Naruto planting the bombs, you got suspicious and went to investigate them. That is... Because I suspected the bombs had disappeared. I thoroughly searched for them inside the military base, but they were nowhere to be found. And because you were searching for them, you were late when we were all gathered. Please listen! And because of that, I reached a conclusion. The bombs Naruto brought were from the military base, which means they were fake bombs. How did you know that they were fake? Um... Because I attempted to use one of them. What? I see. I thought I one of the bombs would be able to be strong enough to blast open the door to the ruin. Hmm, that's kind of... However, that plan was an utter failure. A monomy was there. God damn it, all to hell! <laughs> do you have a minute? There should be no reason for you to doubt me. Yeah, you're right, I got it. Alright, plushy factory. Military base. Nezumi Castle, Naito's room. When I was staring at these monochromas, a thought occurred to me. What? Well? The bomb on the uh, one off the lobby might have been set up here. Huh? How? How did you get up? Do you have a minute? If you hide a bomb inside a monochroma plushie, it would make a frightening weapon. All right. Let's just rip this apart so we can confirm it. Hold on. If there was a bomb inside of these, wouldn't it explode? Easy pie. Either way, it's all gravy. All gravy? What the hell does that mean? Stop! There's no bomb! Hey! You'll know um, if you pick me up, see? All you gotta feel is the soft way of cutting. I see. Hmm, I you're see. right. However... They went in Naki to obtain the bombs. Who knows? I wonder. Hmm. If, you're gonna, if I'm gonna give you guys a hint, then you should know it wasn't from the military base. What? <laughs> well done. I must say, you have a good eye there, Sonya. <laughs> Putting a bomb inside one of my plushies seems like a splendid idea. I mean, it fucking did happen. Why does it seem like it's like some prequel shit? Did I say something I should have not said? It's not your fault, don't worry about it. <laughs> A huge supply of guns and other fireworks are displayed. Whoa! Ah, found it! Hmm, what do you find? Oh, there's my gun over there. Huh? Uh, check be a uh, bed over there, it has guns in it, but I also found stuff like a survival knife. Let's see, that's where it came from. One of the spears is gone. But why the killer use the spear and a knife? Well, yeah. They could have just killed him with a knife and it would have been easier too. With a spear like this, it would have been unnecessary. Looks hard to wield. But they chose it for a reason. Why? There we are. And Monokuma's there. Why are you here, Monokuma? Were you always there? Oh my, you want to go in Nagito's room too? Hajime. Ah, uh, Hajime. What are you gonna do? I'm just listening to Chiaki's request. She wants me to unlock the door to Nagito's cottage. Because she really needs it for the class trial. <laughs> She, make, she begged me to do it while licking my black eye. Um, I didn't do that. I believe you. <laughs> boy, then do crowd. it! It's, cu it's sweet because it's made out of black beans. <laughs> what kind of sexual harassment is this? Ba -ba -ba -loose. <laughs> Ooh, what the fuck? Ew, it does look like a mine. Um, I'm guessing it's obviously the big ass chest box here. Could this be... Oh, it was her treasure. Perhaps. What? You know? Yep. It's really cute. Oh, hell no, Chucky. You know this shit. Oh, she was just reacting. Bullshit. But why would Nagito steal this? In order to find out. Might be good to see what's inside. Hold it. Is it gonna be okay? It looks a little dangerous. Might be, but it's, it might be some kind of clue, you know? It was a notebook. Is it in? Contain sloppy drawings as if they'd be drawn, drawn by children, and entries that look like a chicken scratch. Their one is able to talk to everyone for the first time. Monaco showed up and turned it bad. Day two, Byakuya is the leader. Was it a diary? Um, 
Looks like it. Did Monami write these? Probably. Day 3, day 4, day 5. Poorly written entries continue in the notebook. Don't really understand it, but there ain't any really clues in here. Alright, was I about to give up? My hands probably stopped on entry till day 16. We've been in the funhouse for three days. Everyone's hungry on the edge. How did we try to go to the final dead room today? It's probably panicking because no one believes in. Huh? Hey, hey! How did Did something happen? No one believes him. Oh, it's nothing. Stop it! Hey, stop! Nobody look at my notebook. What? What was so weird about that statement? What did Chiaki write this though? Because she's the only one who saw us. She was the only one there, not Manami. What? You two are definitely related to each other. Chiaki, are you the traitor? Hey, hey. It's pretty much your diary, right? Mm? Diary? Um. Um. It seems that way. That's right, it's my important diary where all my main secrets are in. This is definitely a cover up. Hey! Hey, hey, you're a liar! There we go, Sigma Monokuma. Yeah After all, Monami can't even write! Huh? <laughs> He's saying, geez, I can write letters easily. I can finally write the letter B. That's wrong! No, you can't, because you have no fingers on your damn hands. <laughs> Ooh, this is Chiaki's. Yeah. Shit. She's gonna. She's so focused this part as well. Wah -wah? Huh? Are you mad? Are you angry that I exposed a weakling like you? Hey, hey. So that's what this is about. You're seriously trying to crush me. What are you saying? Hmm. There's no way a big brother would ever crush his little sister. So say like, it's. The time to sell things between us is finally getting closer every second. I don't know why you're getting so serious, but is this what Monokuzuma said is true? Mm -hmm. Huh? You didn't write the notebook? Who wrote it? Um... Um, how should I put it? Bye-bye! Excuse me. Oh, it's Chucky. Jesus Christ, she's the only yep. one who saw it. The fridge. Special poison? Exclusively made for poisoning someone to death. Ooh, he could have used this to die before getting stabbed up. Enchanted liquid is highly potent, takes effect immediately. Ooh. So his volatility is low. The liquid is very dangerous when evaporized. Vaporized. So it could have been done when the fire was there. In a gaseous state, is heavier than air and breaks down in, a, in minutes. It is susceptible to hydrolysis. It's possible to the poison to someone to death with any complications. Keep this liquid secure in a cool place. In glass or plastic container. Keep away from sunlight. Looks like the bottle's left than half empty. So he used it. He definitely used it. Was this from the beginning? Or did Nagito use it? He definitely used it. So where do you put it? Hey, hey. Maybe there's something hidden in this bed. Yeah, like porn. <laughs> Which is checking in the case. Imagine it actually is. No exception about it, I peeked under the bed end. There's something here. Plus it's back from the supermarket, it looks like something's inside. What's this? Ooh, looks like shit to use to transfer the poison. Peeked under the bed once again, so I'll look around. Small piece of paper. Made from blue aluminum. Around thin piece of um, aluminum, huh? Those seals go over jars and uh, uh, unopened mayonnaise. I get what you're saying, but does that mean that piece, this piece, just trash? Wait. Who knows? Might be too soon to decide that. Oh my god! Really, Monokuma? What are you doing in this bath? Get the no. fuck out of there! Only ass bastard. Still a bunch of random books. No oh, way, there's any clues. Ooh, student profiles. If it only has my information, then why? Why is it so thick? <laughs> As soon as I opened it, it was clear to me, just as I thought Nagito had lied to me. Aside from my information, there was information about the others, Kazuichi, Fuiko, Akane, Sonia, everyone who died, pages of information. Oh, we're both reading it. Nice. You're right. My profile is really in here, but unfortunately, there doesn't seem to be any details. Details? Details about our missing memories. Hmm. hmm. 
If it's not written in there, these profiles might have been written before we entered the academy. Hmm. Then it's impossible to obtain new clues from them. Maybe. Yeah. Byakuya. I'm talking about Byakuya Togami. Oh. Look carefully. No matter where I look, I don't see his name anywhere. <laughs> huh? Monogama? No way! So what if his name isn't written in the file? Perhaps based on that, he might be the traitor? No, just because his name isn't written in here. It's not the only thing. He, the reason I think he's suspicious. Yeah, Togami is fucking slim and stuff. Well, it pains me to say this, but... What are you saying about the missing name and about the killing school life? Too bad! It's totally wrong. There's definitely... There's a completely different reason. A different reason? You're getting all riled up! You you guys are getting all worked up about that Byakuya for no reason. Which means the great mystery surrounds that Byakuya doesn't exist. You're basing it on one person's cheap speculation. What do you mean? What the heck? You don't have to ask me. You know the answer right by, just by looking through the profiles, right? Huh? Something that came from the page filled with question marks. The ultimate imposter. No way. Albiakio was a fucking imposter? He was a fake, pretending to be the ultimate affluent progeny, Byakuya Togami. A fake? The ultimate imposter has no name, no permanent address, not even his age and gender is known. He doesn't exist. Because he doesn't exist, he's able to exist as anybody. That's his talent. <laughs> oh, I'm not jealous of that at all. Then he was lying to us the whole time. But still. But he couldn't help it. Why? Oh. Because that was his talent. Huh? Having a talent means you're also bound by that talent. The moment you obtain that talent, your way of life has already been chosen for you. You can't do anything except rely on that talent. Coming from the ultimate gamer. Whether you want to want that life or not. In that sense, compared to the other ultimates, your life might be a little bit more liberating. What the hell? Anyway... Ahem, anyway... I'm not happy that you guys fell for a scam that I had nothing to do with. That's right! So I'll tell you straight up, this revelation about Byakya is exactly the truth. Phew! Jeez, the future foundation is awful. There's no way you should ignore Monomi or the traitor. Who is it? Who's the traitor? Of course! Well, obviously you wouldn't know. I made that file so you guys couldn't find out. Could it be? So you're the one who did it. Hey! In um... fact, there are 60 profiles in there. Is what's wrong? I mean, the trader is a spy sent by Future Foundation, not a student. So, it's not a student. So they're not supposed to be part of these profiles. You made a fake profile for the trader and included that in there too? Correct! What would it be fun if you figured out who the trader is that easily, right? Hey, hey! Then we can use this file to figure out the traitor. That was true for Nagito too, right? Hmm. Well, probably. I see. So, we don't have... Oh, we're done. Okay. It has been an hour. Damn. I'll see you guys next time in the class trial for Nagito Kameja's death. It honestly seems like it's going to be one of the best class trials yet already. Because it's just such a great mystery now. It's actually such a great mystery. I'm excited to participate in this, wondering how it was done. And finally, we're ending it. We're, we're going to find out who the traitor was. It's obviously fucking Chiaki going by these clues, but we'll see. We'll see. See you guys there. Goodbye.